Again, upgrading the firmware on the instrument, uh, as in another video, it can be done by connecting the PC to the instrument, or the quicker method is to simply remove the external SD card from the instrument and uh, place it into a card reader. So, to do so, if you take your instrument, this instrument, the flap is already open, there is another video on how to do that. As you can see, we have an SD card, we just push with the finger now and it will click out. Extract the card. Ooh. There we go, find the instrument. Now here I have a uh, micro SD card reader connected via USB to my PC. So I simply insert that into the slot. Set down. So on the screen I'm prompted, I can open the file. Open the folder, sorry. On the card we have the need to check folder. It's in this folder that all firmware must be placed. So I'm going to uh, update the versions on the card, so on my desktop. I have the version of firmware, so I shall copy this onto the card. I shall replace the existing one. There we have the latest version of firmware uh, in the EtherChip directory on the micro SD card. From here, make sure you eject the card properly. So right click on the card and eject. So now I can simply pull the card from the card reader. <coughs> take my instrument and taking care to put that in, it's, it's fiddly. And with my finger now, click the card back into the instrument.